Welcome back guys, day two. Um, I'm gonna show you another project that I've been working on that I need to finish. I had to stop because it broke. The piece that I'm using here, you can see the line right here actually. It's funny enough. Um, I super glued it. Hopefully that'll hold. If not, I'll put, I'll do something to it. Might put some boards on the back, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, let me just show you, if you wanna see. There's this long piece of wood that I'm carving. All right, I'm almost done completely. I gotta do a little bit more shading in on these, a little bit more shading in on the fence there. I gotta finish the end in the C. Then what I'm gonna do, be careful not to burn myself on the wood burner right here. Uh, then what I'm gonna do Sometime soon, I need to get like a deer head silhouette. I'm gonna do things that I know, you know, for go like, you know, some deer hunt, like a deer, a fish, some, a, you know, different things. You know, a guitar, I don't know. But yeah, I'm gonna, uh, uh. so yeah, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna slide this down here like this so you guys can clearly see what's going on. Slide this down just a little bit without it separating, hopefully. I'm going to super glue a hold. Now this has already been heated up. So again, I have the same uh, tip that I had yesterday. Right? It's the same tip. Alright? It should be ready to burn. Might be not the best because the damn fan is on, but we'll see what happens. Now, I'm going to turn this fan off because it might take more than just a few more minutes. It's probably not fully heated is the problem, to be legitimately honest with you. But, I mean, you can smell. I mean, I, I can anyway. I can smell it burning. So... Let me do you make you look more like you belong there? Oh yeah, it's definitely heating up. Now one thing about wood burning tips, the tips tend to get covered in the smut, the smut mess after, while you're burning. So every now and then what you need to do, and I don't actually have one near me at the moment, is take a piece of sandpaper. Take a piece of sandpaper and you can rub the, sm rub the stuff off of the tip and it'll burn more clean. And don't ever, you know, sandpaper is easier to use because you don't burn yourself with it, right? So this sucker seems to be heating up. Let's just see how it does right now. This is exactly why I had the fan on because the smoke and mess goes right up in your face. Doing here. Huh.
I blow on it sometimes just to keep the smoke out of my face. That's why I usually have the fan on. I'm just doing the shading, you know, trying to get a little deep in there, but mostly just shading it to make it look good. As big as this sign is, you know, I'd either I'm either gonna keep it or I'll sell it to somebody here in Gulf, hopefully. Maybe somebody will wanna take it, hang it up, you know, use it as a display piece. If not, I'm gonna take it and hang it up on my in my on the outside of the garage here. Sorry, daggum cords in the way there. As you can maybe see, whoops, shit, there's the end, see I've shaded all of this right here, it's just basically just doing this, just putting some pressure on it, letting it run across, putting some pressure on it, letting it run across, that's all you're doing, that's all you're doing. Yep. <clears throat> See, I know this is gonna take. See it, and and like I said, I had to practice and practice and practice before I really got doing good projects such as uh, the one I showed you guys yesterday, like my mom's. Yeah, I mean that that took this took a good hour if not longer to do so you know th this takes practice but um yeah but yeah guys um maybe i mean maybe i'll do this i'm also going to show you guys my gun i have a uh, i have a rifle the pellet rifle and I'm carving my name into the stock on that and I think it looks really cool and I think it's gonna look badass when it gets done so yeah um, this is Chris Carroll signing off you guys stay cool